<laughs> My people. Wow, what a good day. What a good day. I am a, I'm a warm weather person. I will tell you that much. I just love that the winter is over. I'm sorry to my people that like the snow out there. I'm so happy. I drove home with the windows down, playing the Big Booty Mix 18 by those guys that mash up all that music. I was just having the time of my life, man. I hope you guys are having the time of your life, or at least are ready to tonight with us, because we got a fun one planned. Guys, I am so excited to see each and every one of you, so let me say hello to each and every one of you from the top. Monster Icon, dude, here super early. Oh, excuse me, Monster Icon's been here for like an hour and a half, dude. He said he uh, has to put his son to bed. I don't know if he's here right now or not, but Monster Icon, so glad to have you. Alchemy, also very early. Alchemy, awesome to have you as well. Great to have you back. Alchemy, I hope you're doing well. PCG Matt says, hey, early people. Matt, dude, we're hopping back on the Minecraft server tonight. I hope to see you in there, but I uh, hope, hope you're having a good one. I never actually saw what you said about, uh, about moving out of Messiah and into another place. I never actually saw if you replied to what I said yesterday or not. Bebby Hayden says, I'm here, Bebby, welcome. Someone called Bebby by her actual name today while we were at dinner. They said something like, they just called her Bella. And like, I was, it was so weird to me. I haven't heard anyone call her anything other than Bebby in months. So uh, anyway, Bebby Hayden, welcome back. So awesome to have you. Still moving down, we got Lily Lou Woo Lily in before a minute. Lily, welcome back. So awesome. Lily, I feel like you haven't missed a stream in a long time. I think I said that a little bit ago, but so glad to have you with us again. Nick Buck also, like the Canadian that he is, says, hey, Zed. Uh, dude, I've had uh, you call me Zed, I guess. I'm sure there's a lot of people around the world that call me Unsurpassable Zed. Uh, Masood Milas wasn't sure if I went by Unsurpassable Z or Zed. That's just weird to me. I think it's cool. I think it's cool, but it's just, you know, obviously no one here says Zed. That's cool. I didn't know they did that in uh, in Canada, though. But Nick, hope you're doing good, man. I know it's like finals season. You might be dead. You might be done, though. Uh, you might be dead also, but you might be done. I hope you are. Nick, welcome. Sammy09, welcome back. Hello, hello, Sammy. So happy to have you. Bigfoot's BFF also says the answer is yes. I do think I'm better than you, of course. I was like, you know what? I'm going to put this out as the go live notification. See what happens, see what people respond to it as, and uh, I have a reason for it, but I thought that would just be a fun way to do it. I don't know. I, I figured I'd test it out and see if it was fun. Uh, so far, you and Will PK have both said something to me about thinking that they're better than me. <laughs> uh, we also, moving down the list, Exotic Noodle is here. Exotic Noodle, hiya, welcome, man. Great to have you. <laughs> That's Will PK's hand poking out over the top of the curtain, and now he's going back upstairs. Uh, his first appearance on stream. Exotic Noodle, awesome to have you. Welcome, welcome. Ice Cream Man, also enjoying a little bit of the Binding of Isaac. So great to see it. You'll, dude, he is so into that game. I remember, so I, I think I said this story a little bit ago, um, but I'll tell it again just really quickly. Ice Cream Man and I went to school together, and he was also an engineering major, and he won a really, like, honorable award at the end of the year. It was, you know, for all intents and purposes, it was best engineer in the entire program, all right, from our year. And so uh, Ben gets this award, like this honorary thing named after the first head of the engineering department at our school, you know? And then later that night, I go and I like go over to his apartment to hang out with him. And he's just like laying on the couch, shirtless, playing the Binding of Isaac on his laptop, just like leaned back, just having the time of his life. So uh, just the duality of ice cream, man. Uh, but I know you love that. So that's awesome, man. Bearman001, what's up, dog? My fellow zoo worker. Uh, Bearman, what are the odds that you could steal a flamingo for me. Do you think that's something reasonable that could be achieved? You know, I'm not saying like, would you, just could you? And then if the answer is yes, also would you, please. I would really appreciate that. W carry, man, baseball season's almost over. I hope that the grind is uh, fun for you. Hope you're having a good time. Hope to see you in the streams more after it's over. We've missed you, man. We have missed you. Atlas, what is up? Asks, what are your opinions on the fake unsurpassable Zs in the Discord server? I'll talk about that in a little bit. Um, yeah, I'll talk about that in a little bit because uh, I have it written down on my to do. I want to I want to get through all the people first before I before I start talking. Atlas, don't let me forget. Welcome, welcome, great to have you. Twisted Gaming has returned. Says well, hi, Twisted Gaming. It's so great to have you back again. Awesome. I know you, we were just here. Like, was it yesterday or was it Monday? I think I can check that. Let me look. Yeah, it was just yesterday, I guess. Wow, feels like a feels like a lifetime ago. Feels like we're such good friends already. Twisted, welcome. Awesome to have you. Fugo also, hey, what's up, dude? Welcome. Great to have you. Keen is here. She is not in the studio. She is 
in her home upstairs. Uh, Keen, welcome. It's great to have both of you guys. Azira, Azira, I hope I'm saying that correctly. Uh, tell me if I'm not though. It says, hello, first time viewer. Guys, welcome Azira to the chat. Awesome to have you. Hope that you're having a great time. Thanks for joining. Uh, yeah, we, we got a fun one for you. So I'm, I'm glad to have you. Can't wait to get to know you more. Melancholy says, hey, Melancholy, what's up? Welcome back. Welcome back. Melancholy, I'm glad you can come around more again. We lost you for a little bit to the busy work schedule, but you're back and we're happy about that. Super K64, uh, snow is bad here in Brazil. We don't have that. Ooh, wow. Interesting. Yeah, that's a, uh, you know, I don't know. I've lived in a place that doesn't like really get like an insane amount of snow, but it's definitely like, like I think one time last year we had like, yeah, last year's winter, we had one snowfall all winter and it was super weird. Like that never happens to even have one, but, uh, there's like so many people that just never experience it. And if they never go away, there's so many people that like live into their adult years having never seen snow and that is just wild to me, you know? Uh, and then it's also wild to the people who just like only know snow, but yeah. Super K, very glad to have you, a friend from Brazil. Welcome, welcome. Uh, moving down, Blade is also here, says hello to Will PK's hand, but not to me. I understand, I understand. Blade, welcome. <laughs> it's funny, man. Uh, Blade, dude, I saw your comment on my last video. Guys, I posted, we, we had talked about, I posted the video of myself and Bonds and Penguin Panda and M getting the world record in the boiler room. And Blade commented on that and he was like, this is really entertaining, but as someone who works to optimize these routes, this really hurt to watch. And Blade, you know what? I think that's the exact sweet spot I'm looking for. So glad that you enjoyed it. Emmy K says, sup guys. Emmy, I was talking with M after the last stream because we raid, uh, we raided Bonzinator at the end of the last stream. And I was talking, Emmy, I don't even remember what Emmy said. She said something really funny about like, uh, oh, Bonds, you did so good, you queen, or something like that. We are like, oh my god, Emmy is so supportive. It's great to have you, Emmy. Thanks for uh, being yourself. Um, it was yesterday I brought that ra Oh, that's right, you were the one who actually raided. That's right, gotcha, that's right, that's right. Thank you, Twisted, for the raid again. I appreciate that. I remember that you were a part of that crew. I forgot that you were actually the one streaming, though. Hope that that was uh, fun for you. Kenzie May says, hello, hello, Kenzie. It's awesome to see you back again as well. Kenzie, it's been a little bit. I, I missed you. Welcome. Uh, we got the Rosling. Also, Rosling, welcome back. It's great to have you. Hope that you're doing good. Hi again to you too. Um, Bear Mets a show Clash of Clans base. Oh, is there even is there even an easy way to do that? I need to find a way to like broadcast my phone. But yeah, here I'll I'll show a little Clash of Clans. But uh, guys, we got a, a banger tonight. A bunch of fun variety uh, as we do on Thursdays. I will announce also. I think this is going to be the last full variety stream that we do. I think from now on, we're going to do a little bit of mixing it up. We're going to have some Stardew in every stream and we're going to have some variety in every stream or just whatever I feel like uh, rather than having a designated day for variety stuff and designated days for Stardew. I think it'll spread it out a little bit more evenly and uh, it'll be easier for me to plan as well. So uh, anyway, but for tonight, at least we are doing full variety at eight o'clock uh, in just 15, 20 minutes from now. We're playing chess, uh, the game of gentlemen against you particularly the Twitch subs. It's open for anyone, but I'm going to give the subs priority if they want to get in. We're going to play a, uh, I'm going to try to see how many fun varieties I can find, like how many fun variants I can find of chess, because I know there's good ones. Like Fog of War is a really cool one that I want to try out. Um, I, I just know there's like a couple of cool, fun variations to chess that I'd like to do instead of just normal games. So we're going to play that. Uh, and then about halfway through, I'm going to hop on the Minecraft server and I have a new project for us there. Guys, if you've never played Minecraft with us before and you play on Java, it's a 1.16 server and it is very fun. It's the ZSMP, as many people call it. A bunch of people from the server play on it. A bunch of people play a lot on it, I should say. And uh, we are going to be playing on that server and I'm starting the, the Stardew, uh, recreating Stardew Valley in Minecraft. That project's almost over. There's still plenty of work to be done, but it's almost over. And I want to start another fun little project. This is just a side thing, but I want the faces of all of the Stardew characters, like pixel art style. I want them like, I want like a corridor that just has all their faces. I don't know how to make that happen, but we're going to try it. So I don't know where it's going to go. I just want like this long tube of just people's faces, like Abigail, 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 Gus, 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 Willy, 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 you know, just all over the place so that you can get the full experience of them in uh, in 1080p. Uh, and so that's what we're starting tonight on the Minecraft server. That'll be a little later though. And I hope that you guys will join me and aid me in my quest to build all that stuff. <laughs> Blade said hi on Surpassable Z's hand. Thank you, Blade. 
<laughs> oh, that's funny, yeah. So, uh, anyway, that's the schedule for the night. Bearman requested I show the Clash of Clans base, and I will, because I'm proud of it. Last time I showed this, I had actually, like, pre-recorded something, but this time, I'm just gonna hold the phone up to the camera and show you guys. I'm very proud of my progress. I started playing this, like, two, maybe, maybe three months ago. I think it was, like, two and a half months ago. I started playing. Your boy's Town Hall 7, all right? Well on my way to Town Hall 8. I'm almost caught up to where I was when I used to play this game in high school. And if you look at my base, don't mean to flex or nothing. Come on, focus. I got all purple walls. Are you kidding me? All freaking purple. Walls maxed for Town Hall 7. And so I'm very proud of that. I've got like money in the bank, like I'm Drake. I got good plants. I got my fourth builder's hut, excited for that. We've been losing the last couple of wars. That's not so hot, but other than that, it's going pretty good, I would say. So, if anyone wants to join the uh, Clash of Clans clan, uh, someone could tell you how to do that. There's a channel in Discord. Um, yeah, I, I don't even know how to join the clan, but someone could tell you. It's called the Flamboyance. <laughs> wow, Super K's never seen snow. One of those people. That's crazy, Super K. Absolutely crazy, man. To have never even seen it. But yeah, it is. It do be hot in Brazil. <laughs> Oh, man, see, I feel like a lot of people have parents that are good at chess and try to get their kids into it, and then they just, like, aren't into it as much, and then their parents just keep pushing and keep pushing, and it never works, but, uh, yeah. Blade says, I haven't played chess in years. Awful a bullet was decent when I can analyze. Yeah, I was always better at, like, the long... Because, like, I don't know, I can think... If I have unlimited time to think, I think I'm pretty good, you know? But yeah, killer in the house, baby killer, what's up? Welcome back, great to have you. Uh, <laughs> I'm in a clan already, I'm sorry, but how can I be in a clan on Clash of Clans other than the flamboyance, named after, you know, us, right here on the stream, so. I'm sorry, killer, you guys can join mine if you want to, but I am uh, committed. <laughs> Rosling just says mustacheless Lewis, God, what a sin. I really take pride in, after I've like, you know, make, I've been making content for a while, and, uh, yeah, I've been making content for a long time, and I think just my favorite part about it is just that I have the power to introduce sin into the world in the form of Limitator Lewis without a mustache, you know, just other other fun things like that. So yeah. Sarasuki, thank you for the good news. Just wanted to let you know NBA 2K21 is free on Epic Games in case your chat is interested in it. Thank you for uh, spreading the good news, Sarasuki. I appreciate that. Guys, if you play 2K, there you go. Free on Epic Games. Epic Games gives away a bunch of good stuff. Wow, is that game 60 bucks? Sarasuki, you are doing the Lord's work. I appreciate it. Thank you very much. Um, maybe we should get that. Who knows? Um, I also, so I, I think what uh, I think what Rosling was saying about Mustacheless Lewis at that time exactly was when I was talking about the, the Hall of Faces. And even if they weren't, I don't know. I'm going to do this. I think one of the faces, so I, I, my picture, my end goal is that I want to have like a whole long hallway where it's just like each wall and the ceiling and the floor is the person's face, you know? And you just walk down the hall and you just like are always constantly surrounded by the, the Stardew characters, you know? And I think Mayor Lewis without a mustache could be achieved. I think we could work towards that. At least one of those walls, like if you look really closely, like the one on the floor, he doesn't have a mustache or the one on the ceiling or something. I think that could be fun. <laughs> oh, that's great. <laughs> Sarasuki says, I am Messiah. <laughs> Oh, that's funny. Puzzle Freak, I'm sorry I missed you when you came in, I think. I think I missed you. Puzzle Freak, it's so good to have you. Welcome, welcome. Very happy. So, geez. <clears throat> I got, like, the schniffles right now. So forgive me. <clears throat> if I sound a little bad, it is allergy season for me. I got, like, a three-week window where I am just, like, sneezing like crazy for, like, non-stop. I'll sneeze, like, seven or eight times in a row. I'll be stuffy sometimes, randomly. I don't know. I apologize if I sound stuff, uh, stuffy tonight. I might have to go take a, a nose blow break at some point. But guys, I want to share a, uh, a quick little story with you as well. Uh, Messiah does not have any rest time. Got to spread the message. Thank you, Sarasuki. Thank you for uh, joining us. Thank you very much. I appreciate the, uh, the kind words as well. Um, yeah, can we appreciate the mug? I got this as a gift a while ago, two years ago, well before I started streaming. Let's flamingle. And uh, I totally, I streamed with the theme of flamingos for like eight or nine months before I realized that that mug fits perfectly. I don't know why I didn't have that. I don't know why I wasn't using it, but I do now. Um, I want to share a story. So if you guys remember on Wednesday, I told you about this girl, Allison, who came to the office 
And apparently I'm sitting at her desk, the desk that she used to sit at. Like she was, she's a junior, just finished her junior year in college. So she's an intern, right? She's working with the architects and I'm over with the engineers, you know, the cool ones. And so I come, I, I come in on Monday for the first day, sit down, they put me there. They're like, yeah, you can have Allison's desk. She'll move over there with the architects. And so then she comes in and they're like, it's kind of awkward, you know, like with the way that they have us seated, like I can barely see her eyes up over this little wall. So I keep like making eye contact and like looking away. It's very awkward. Now, on top of that, my, my over or my supervisor, right? He comes over, he talks to her <clears throat> and he's like, oh man, Zach got your desk, huh? Everyone thinks they're funny in the office. Everyone thinks they're super funny for saying, ha ha, you gotta get here quicker, you know? They're not funny, but everyone thinks they are. So he comes over and he talks to her and he's like, oh yeah, Zach got your desk. Oh, do you want a bigger monitor? So at work, they have these like ridiculously big, I actually have the same monitor. I have a 27 inch Dell something or other 4K monitor over here. And they have like the 42 inch version that's 4K just as a monitor. It's like this massive thing that sits on my desk that I just look at in awe all day with like AutoCAD in one corner and like I got my email in another corner and I got Microsoft Teams up here and I got cat videos and I got like I just got like a sensory overload on this 4k 42 inch monitor and they moved her to this new desk that didn't have one she was using a dinky little pathetic 24 inch monitor Ugh, imagine right and so he was like do you want one I don't know, it just felt awkward. It felt awkward that I was also using Allison's monitor. I also found a key like stashed away in my desk drawer that was probably hers that I just haven't told her about yet. I don't know. She went over to the intern who's gonna start in two weeks. She went over to his desk and just took his TV. And so I guess that worked out for both of us and it's really bad for him. But in the meantime, I guess we're okay. <laughs> oh man, Will says he's sick and he's living in my house. I'm sick because of you, Will sick because you go to public school every day and you come back and cough on me. <laughs> a bunch of comedians. Yeah, it is cicada season. That is, uh, cicadas are in right now. They're very in. And, uh, unfortunately, they are covering, uh, M M's house. Like, their lawn is just, like, covered in them. I stepped, I was, like, walking out to work this morning, almost stepped on one. They're so squishy. I don't know why they've got so much squish to them. But it's, like, actually a really big big operation, big, big miss, mishap if you end up stepping on one. So sad. All right, let me show you guys something else or, or something else that also happens before we get going on chess. Here we are in the discord. Let me show you someone joined today. I, I'm sitting at work, right, doing my thing and I get this notification because I have notifications turned on for people join the server. Unsurpassable Z, welcome to the flamboyance. What? Who do you think you are, man? Unsurpassable Z joins the Discord today. He's got this profile picture, which is my profile picture, but like it's the emote. Like it doesn't even have the background like my picture does and it's super low quality. And so I don't know who this was. I I freaking love you guys. Some Someone started to react to this message with what? And then someone else reacted imposter to when he joined. So anyway, both of those things are fun. Oh, hi, Kenzie. Um, so then, in general, up here, Unsurpassable Z joins. Where is he? I think I'm, uh, where is he? Where is he? Yeah, dude, see, this is, like, where, where even is he? I don't know. He's, like, the pink Unsurpassable Z. He might have changed back, and now it won't show. Oh, yeah. So, he joins, and I immediately say, at Unsurpassable Z, explain yourself, imposter, and he just says, never. And then, uh, he says, I guess we'll never know. Still don't know who it is. Oh, there's a typo in it. I don't know. I, I don't think it was like that, but now the name is Unsurpassable Z. <laughs> so I don't know who this was, but I thought it was funny at least. Um, and then Snoop changed his name also. Snoop changed his name to Unsurpassable Z. He changed it back, but uh, he was also pretending to be me. So I don't care. If you want to like have your name be something like that or just close and like have a weird profile picture, go ahead. But I don't want to confuse new people. So I do have to now add a rule that says don't pretend to be Zach which I didn't think I was gonna have to add, but apparently I do. <laughs> oh, why are all these messed up? These were like centered before. I think Discord changed their text sizes and now I gotta, oh man, gosh, now I gotta do that. Anyway, so that happened earlier today. I thought that was really funny. Frozen Pizza 37 is here. He says, are you in Maryland now? Sam, we share a state. How beautiful is that? This is not my house or my apartment. I'm living with M until my apartment lease starts, but I am in the same state as you. How cool is that? 
Like, we're like an hour away from each other. Imagine. Imagine the power. <laughs> Imagine the potential, you know? <laughs> oh, Lerpa, what is up? Had trouble connecting in the car. We're good now. I'm not sick. No, Will is just saying I'm sick. I'm just, like, allergy stuffy, you know? But Will likes to bully me, so... Uh, Lerpa, I hope your vacation's going great. I know you've been busy. Sorry, I've been busy as well. I can't wait to keep hearing more about it. Bross is here. Bross is I'm here. Oh, Bross, we miss you. Welcome back. Just in time for chess. Bross's favorite activity. <laughs> oh, man. So, yeah, anyway, that's, uh, that's what we got going on for the night. That's what I had to tell you guys. I think I probably have a couple more things I could talk about, but we'll save it. Um... Yeah, I will say though also, just quick announcement, I have no details on this at this point, but I'm doing a charity stream next Thursday. I told myself I wanted to do like at least two charity streams a year, and we did one in December, and we raised $500, 500 freaking dollars, a lot of money. There's a bunch of fun incentives that came along with that, um, and now we are going to be doing a charity stream again. I have not picked the charity, I don't know what we're doing, but it will be on Thursday, and it will be from 7.30 to 10.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, same time as normal. And so, come on out. Even if you can't donate monetarily, it will be great to uh, just have you guys. What do we do if we recognize you in public? Just scream Unsurpassable Z and wave at me, and then scream your own name so I can identify you. And then you have three words. You have a max of three words to talk to me. I'm very busy. Please don't stop and talk to me. Just three words. Choose them very wisely. <laughs> I've been recognized in public two times. And it was because there were two people that I did not know from real life, but they were like real life connections. Like one was Matt's sister and one was Matt's sister's friend. And so both of them went to school with me, but I didn't know who they were until the stream started. And I was at like, I was just out and about and they knew me because they knew what I looked like, obviously. And they both said unsurpassable Z. They didn't know how to do it either. I don't know. It'll probably be awkward, but it'll be fun for everyone. So, <laughs> oh man. Lerpa is here just in time to see all of her emotes being used. That's right, it's the last day of the unsert pog with my mom's face on it. So, wow, she's using it. There it is. <laughs> oh, that's great. Guys, let's play some chess. The gentleman's game. Anyone can play any game, but not everyone can be good at every game. And this is one of those games that I'm not good at. I don't know. I'm kind of decent. I play a little bit. I want to play chess against a you guys though, so I'm going to uh, sit here in this lobby right here. I'm going to go chess uh, in a second, and if you guys want to play me, I think my name is just Unsurpassable Z, and I think that's how you do it. And then you guys will send me a request, and I will accept it. Don't ask me to send you a request because I don't know how to. Uh, Chrome, where are you? Properties. Chess.com. There we go. Transition. So here we are on chess.com. Uh, yeah, you guys can just send me a request to play. The first, I, I think I'm going to do some fun variants later, but I want to do some normal games for now. So I think we're going to do uh, games that progressively have less and less time on the clock. So I think our first game is going to be a 20 minute game, then a 10 minute game, then five, then three, then one, then 15 seconds. All right, so uh, Bros just asked me for a three minute game. Decline, so send me 20 minute requests right now. Um, 20 minutes for each of us. We'll have a nice, long, thinky kind of match. Is Blade still around? I think Blade might have left, but uh, if he if he didn't, then he could come play. Musely, welcome back. It's great to have you. Musely says thanks for the gift sub to Melancholy. How awesome is that? Musely, thank you for uh, for joining us again. Uh, Blade's still here. Blade, if you wanted to play, man, I said I would give preference to the subs, but also, I don't know, man, you did say that you're good on the long, thinky games. So maybe, maybe I could make an exception. <laughs> it says 10 and 30 minutes. Oh, wait, this isn't right. Bros just sent me another three-minute request? I don't know. The request will come in. Sam says he sent me a request. Where are they? Here we go. I got one from Sam. And I got one from Lily Luwu. I think Lily is subbed. I'll do Lily first. Sam, I'm sorry, but we're doing we're doing subs. Get priority. Got to give them some some sort of reason to uh, to be subscribed, other than you know supporting me. Hey, here's a, an advertisement for the school that I already graduated from. That's kind of cool. All right, so we'll get in with Lily Luwu here first. Lily Wuhu. God, I can never say her name right. All right, this game is live. She is white. Think very carefully. She says, I'm going to lose so fast. I apologize. <laughs> oh, 
Let's see it, Lily. Lily is subscribed now. Been subscribed for only one month. She opens with E4. We will do the Sicilian. We should do a prediction, a prediction for this one. I'll start it. Who will win? Zach or Lily? You guys have a minute to bet. Go ahead. <laughs> Lily's gonna bet against herself, I bet. Okay, okay, not too bad. Let's uh let's develop some let's let's take some space in the middle. Boop. See if we can get that pawn out in the middle. Nice. I will take your pawn. Can't really take it back. Lest you get captured by me. <laughs> These long thinky kind of games are the ones that I tend to do better at. But by the time we're done, we're going to be playing with uh, 15 seconds on the clock, each of us. Which just gets wild. This is fancy checkers. It is indeed fancy, fancy checkers. Um, I want to I wanna tell you guys also then... I, I don't know. Maybe I should wait until I uh, until after the weekend. I was brainstorming all sorts of stuff that I want to do in the future here, and I think uh, I've got I've got some really big plans and some fun ideas for videos and everything that I want to do. All right, Lily, what is going on here? I'm taking that knight. I think I'm just gonna take this knight. <laughs> just going right for it. <laughs> oh yeah. Lily is rated 1038. I'm rated 738, apparently. I also never play this version. So I guess we'll have to see. I normally play like five minute games online or very, very long games. This is already not an opening that's like, you know, in the books. All right, interesting. I think I might, I think I'll just push her back here. Maybe I could bring a, the knight out. Do I want to bring the knight out instead? No, I don't want to pin my knight. Be gone with you, bishop. <laughs> uh, yeah, I know openings are like the hardest part. It's always just like I, I was just like blindly memorizing openings for a while. I realized there's so many more like places to improve beyond openings that I had to work on first. <laughs> At least this has been like five years since I've been good. Yeah, that's rough. I I say this every time we play chess, but I come and go in like waves of interest with chess. Sometimes I'm way into it, sometimes I'm not. I was way, way into it in the early, like, spring. Yeah, sorry, Sam. Thank you for your interest, though. I hope we can get a game in then. I'll also try to prioritize people that we haven't played chess against before. I think I'm going to take this bishop. I think I'm just going for it. Yeet. <laughs> Lily said no one told my dad about this. So far, I'm up six. On the exchange right now. It's a little rough for Lily, I won't lie. She is giving me some good pieces for free. A little bit of a handicap. I bet Lily ends up being cracked, though. <laughs> uh, Bra says I haven't played in like three months. I had to stop playing against all of you guys. I said at one point, just send me a request and I'll play against you. I had to stop. I had way too many games going at the same time. It, I couldn't keep track of my games anymore. It was actually ridiculous. It was ridiculous how many games I had going. Couldn't keep track. I was starting to like lose. I don't know. I was starting to lose everything. I also started playing a game a while ago uh, against M's roommate, Manushka. If you guys remember Manushka, she hasn't been around for a while, but if you remember Manushka, I played against her dad. Because her dad was also like how Lily said that her dad, you know, really cares about her doing well. I was playing. Uh, I played a game against him because he was like way into chess and uh, he and him and I were like going at it. We had the most theoretical opening I've ever had. Like it went it went really deep into theory. It was the it was like the most theoretical opening that I knew. And so I was really excited to just get to that point. And then it, then it stopped being theory. And I was like, oh, God, what's happening? And then I let that game run out because I didn't move for 14 days. My bad. And uh, he was kind of sad about that. But, you know, <laughs> All right, Lily thought for a really long time on that one. How am I going to reply? I kind of want to get an attack going just right away. I kind of want to start going for the kill. I guess she's bringing this pawn out to maybe get this bishop out. Maybe I could bring this 
pawn up and open my bishop? Perhaps, perhaps. Because I was going to try to get this bishop right here onto this square, but I was like, well, she can just push this pawn forward, but now she can't because I can just take it then. Uh, that's also not true. Whatever. Let's open things up. Let's see. I've only got 18 minutes left. I got to start playing fast. <laughs> can I blame ADHD for this, dude? Lily, you got it. Come on. <laughs> Bold of you to assume I'm thinking, of course, of course. I just got a friend request on chess.com from Monster Icon. You better believe it. Dude, Monster Icon gets first dibs. Freaking tier three. Tier three gifts a million subs. Ooh, Lily wants my queen. I'm not going to let you have it. Not that easily. Maybe I could force a trade. Maybe I could just go right here. Not force a trade, but I could go there and then my bishop is guarding it. Does that threaten anything? I guess it threatens I'll take this pawn with check, which means I could probably win something. Oh, yeah. Okay. I have an idea. I have an idea. Lily's going to stream snipe me, but you know. Oh, Monster Icon said no chance I play you. I'm trash, dude. Come on. Do it in the 15 second game, Monster. Do the 15 second one. <laughs> oh, man. Melancholy. I'm so sorry that you're having side effects from the uh, the second COVID shot. Mine ended up being like nothing. Like I was just, I was totally good. I didn't feel under the weather at all. How dare you, Lily? Who do you think you are? Who do you think you are? See, if I go here... I have to block with the knight now. I can't block with the bishop, because then she'll take it with check, and I'll have to take it back, and then I lose my queen. So I'm going to take it. Or I'm going to block this way. That's my idea. That's the idea, at least. <laughs> hey, Rama, what's up? Welcome. Here's to those who clearly played chess pre-Netflix show. That's right. You can look at my uh, my account creation date on uh, on chess.com. You can look and see that I'm an OG. It wasn't just because of Queen's Gambit. <laughs> Could have recaptured with Queen? Could have recaptured... What, I'm sorry, what do you mean, Blade? Where? Can I go back? I can. So here... Do you mean, uh, do you mean she could have? Hmm. I don't know. We'll see. Ooh, a pawn. Pawn moves up. This is scary. Except I think I can just take this with check. And win this pawn. Pretty sure. I don't want to accidentally lose a queen. I don't want to mess around and, and lose a queen right off the rip. But if I do this, then she can't block it, so she's going to have to move her king and ruin her castling. Absolutely ruined. <laughs> Don't ever think I'm just vibing. I know, Lily. They will never let me hear the end of it. I'm already called a Stardew noob almost every day. I mean, I got the statue to prove it. I know you can't read it when it's small, but just the chicken statue says Stardew noob. I can't let them also call me chess noob. If blocked with bishop and then taken with check, I could have retaken with the queen. That's right, to get that out of there. Okay, I see what you're saying now. Yeah, so right here, Blade was saying, I could have blocked this with the bishop. Uh, it won't let me show it in the middle of the game. If you can imagine, I could have blocked with the bishop and then if she retook, I could have taken with the queen. So I could have got out of there. All right. So she ends up moving. I could just take this pawn. Is there anything better to do? I don't know. Maybe I could... I can't really get a check in any way. I could try to develop a piece. Try to develop a bishop or something. So then I could castle. But really, I don't know. Maybe I should just... Oh, I can't just take this pawn. Never mind. The queen is going to get eaten. Oh my god, could you imagine? See, that's why I can't play fast chess. I was fully prepared to just take this pawn. I can come here with check. With ideas. I'll try that. Mick, like Manushka, hates playing against me.
because I I check a lot. I really do. She absolutely hates it. Yeah, I know. I, I can talk about my chess moves and my logic and my, like, reasoning as if I'm an authority on chess in any way, but I'm absolutely not. <laughs> yeah, I, uh... Yeah, my, my second COVID shot was very, very easygoing. I really appreciated not having to deal with, you know, recovering. What do we do here? What do we do? I can check her with my knight, but that doesn't do anything. I have a feeling... I have a feeling there's good things. Alright, let's just relax. Let's just calm down. Let's start developing some stuff. I'm in no immediate threat. Um, if I open up... Here, see this... Okay, this pawn has just not been guarded this whole time from her queen. But moving it forward also doesn't guard it. Oh no, it's been guarded by this bishop, that's right. So maybe... Maybe I could bring a knight into the mix. Maybe I could... Bring this knight up. Maybe I could bring this bishop out, then I could castle. I never end up castling when I should. Alright, I'm gonna go here so that I can push this pawn. And just hopefully, like, open up the middle somehow. I don't really know. Take the pawn, do it, says Lily. <laughs> should I do it for the content? Should I, uh, should I take this pawn next time? For Lily? Oh, interesting. Maybe we do it for the content. I don't know. How confident am I? What do you think? Should I just like take a pawn so that she can then take my queen? What's the best pawn to take? She wants to trade queens. I could go here and take that one. And this boy's unguarded. I could take this one and then she'll come to there and then this is open. I don't know how that being open helps. Yeah, if I go here, boom, boom. You know what? Let's do it for the content. Yeet! <laughs> I may regret this. There's so many believers in the chat, but you know, you gotta, you gotta give them a reason to be scared. <laughs> she says it's a win-win for me either way because she bet against herself. Love to see it. All right, we're into it. I got two pawns for the queen. That's a good trade. Very good trade. <laughs> I don't think I'm that good at chess. This this will be really hard to win. I'm actually quite scared. Now I need the castle. Uh-oh. She wants to attack me. Um, I'm eating everything. She's gonna have only that queen left by the time I'm done. I could have also moved this knight here to fork both of these pieces, I guess. Oh, no, I couldn't. That knight is pinned. Silly me. Not for long, though. Yeah. See, Blade, I'm telling you, man, you would beat me. I think you would beat me. It takes me a second to see stuff. Which fork did I miss, Will? I'm forking right now. Oh, I missed the fork over here for the rook. Yeah, it's because I was so focused on this one. It's all right. I just traded one fork for another. I'm getting this bishop out of here. God, I missed so many forks. My weakest point. Oh, uh, man. Yeah, I'm sorry to Canada for not having vaccines yet. It is crazy. Like, people are just not wearing masks anymore because they're vaccinated. You know, it's like you don't need to. It is just wild to uh, be living in the world like that again. I'm happy for the future. Yeah, I guess you do lose the knight, too, if you take the rook. But And I'm unpinning my knight. <laughs> hey, I gave up the queen. I'm ready for action. I'm ready for anything right now. I gotta get some other pieces in there, though. Right now, I've kind of got one one piece doing all the work. Alright, king's going back. 
King is going back, afraid, as always. I could... Yeah, I'll just, I'll just take this, I guess. The king has run away. Oh, <laughs> Lily said it just took her a long time to realize she was even in check. That is unfortunate. Whoa! Oh my goodness, Lily. Absolutely ate my bishop up. Well, that was aggressive. I'll take that, though. I'm happy with that. I'll take that, uh, that free rook. Yeah, I think, uh, I'm, I'm surprised that more people aren't making the vaccines required. It's all optional everywhere. I guess it makes sense. I mean, you don't want to force people to just, like, inject stuff into them. But we already do. Like, there's already a bunch of vaccines you have to get as a human. So, yeah, I don't know. What's she going for? She wants this pawn now? I guess that baby is undefended. Maybe I could... Where can I go? That's fun. I could bring this knight here. And it's defended. Do I want to do that, though? Maybe... Yeah, let's, let's just do that. Let's just see what, what happens. I don't know. I'm ready to trade some stuff down. I'm up eight material. Like, up, I'm plus eight on her right now. <laughs> oh, Lily. You're doing great, Lily. <laughs> Lily is thriving right now. Lily, focus on the game. You don't have to talk to me. It's okay. Whoa, 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 Lily, Lily. Let's be cool. Let's be cool here. Might just block like this. I don't know. I'm losing this pawn, I think. Maybe I can... Is there any way? I can't block that any other way. Other than the rook or this pawn. If I block with that pawn, then I just lose it. But that gives me a turn. To do other fun things. Uh, yeah. Can't require it until two years after. Hmm. Two years, long time. Long, long time. There's a clip of XQC talking about the vaccine and just about like herd immunity. And he's like, you have to realize if you're not getting this thing, you're literally getting carried, which is just the most gamer way to say that sentence at all. <laughs> How are we feeling about Lily right now, guys? Is this a, a good experience or is this a sad time? Okay. Lily is going to soon be down to just the queen. Just the queen. See, I'm kind of bad at checkmating, which makes me scared. I feel like she may slip around for a little bit. Might end up being a stalemate. She's got eight more minutes on her clock to think about things. Hey, we raided Bonsonator last night. And when I was in the middle of watching her, like, accept the raid, I was like, man, this song that she's playing, I think that the, I think I have this song on my stream playlist. That's crazy. And then I realized, like, it was just my music still playing from my stream. <laughs> I like, just had it open in, a, in the uh, the other window still. Okay, Lily, what's the deal here? I gotta make sure she doesn't have any perpetual checks. Let me get out of here. I get my king to safety. Is that the safest spot? Probably not. I don't think blocking it does anything. Because if, if she blocks it, she'll just go here. Or if I block it, she'll just go there. Ah, that's still alright. Yeah, I'll just block it. That's fine. <laughs> Car, welcome! It's so great to have you. Welcome, welcome. Car, I hope you're doing good. I haven't had a thought in years. Oh my god. <laughs> yeah, whenever you play against Will PK, word to the wise, he will play until the game is over. It doesn't matter how far he's down. Like, he'll have a king and one pawn and you'll have all your pieces and he will try his hardest to get a stalemate. Okay, we're doing that then. Um, do I want to go back? 
Or do I want to go... See, I was thinking I would just go here, but then she can get this little bishop. No, she can't, because my rook's guarding it. I'm going here now. I just gotta start getting some checks in on her. I'd actually quite like it if she took that bishop. Oh my gosh, Lily. You're being whack right now. <laughs> there. I'll just keep moving up until my pawn gets somewhere, or until my king gets somewhere safe. Yeah, Mick has stalemated you. I, we had talked about that too, where we played for like a bunch of moves, and then finally, Mick ended up uh, ended up stalemating, and it was just so sad because I was like, oh my god, you just like gave him so much hope for the future. You know, now he thinks that it's worth playing on because there's always a chance that he might win. Uh, let's see, what is going on here, Lily? I'm going right here. I don't know what's happening. <laughs> don't mind me just watching every chess video in existence. Oh my god, Lily coming in the back door. Let's go. Can't block this with anything. Oh, I can't move that. Let me go here. She can still check me, dude. I just want to go somewhere that she can't check me anymore. Now I know why Mick hates this. Okay, you know what? New strategy. New place to run away. We're going through this this way. The Canyon of Safe Passage. That's what it's called. She's going to pick up this rook. I don't even care. I just want my king to be safe. Oh, never mind. Not picking up the rook. <laughs> She's got seven more minutes on the clock. And she stalemate in that time. Okay, now I go here. Now I lose the rook. Nope, just kidding. Still didn't lose the rook. And now my king, I think, is finally safe. I don't think she can check me from here. Oh, bless up. I'm finally out of the vicious loop. Now I'm doing it to her. She gets no, no more mercy. <laughs> it was very kind of her to let me keep that, uh, the rook and the bishop and everything that whole time. Really appreciated that. Alaroda, every time I see a truck driver now, I think of you. And there's a lot of truck drivers out there. It is a very unique occupation. Six minutes left for Lily. We play a whole game in this time period. This is the slowest of our games. I think the next one I'll do will be a five minute one, or maybe I'll do like a fog of war. Might try to do a fun thing like that. All right, check number one. Was that the best one? Probably not. Is that the one I did? Absolutely. I just want to keep her king, like, in a bad spot. Yeah. Yeah, run away. Run away. <laughs> Let me bring another piece into this somehow. Maybe I can start bringing this brave pawn up to the front. Maybe I'll go knight. Now, the knight's actually kind of helpful in, like, keeping my... Oh. Oop. Don't talk to me. Literally, she moved her queen right there. And I didn't even see that I could take it. I cannot believe that, dude. Literally, no one even said anything either. <laughs> oh, Alaroda, that'd be funny. Okay, things are looking a little sad right now for Lily. There's, uh, there's plenty of game left. Let's... Let's leave that pawn there for now, so I don't accidentally stalemate. Let's see, we got these squares covered, and these two. How can I cover this square? There's no easy way- oh, I can move this knight right here, 
And then all I have to do is put her in check. Something else. Are you kidding me? Are you actually kidding me right now? Unbelievable. <laughs> what a brave pawn. I want no backseating, Blade. Now nah, you, you guys can say stuff if you want. The games aren't serious. I'm fully hysterical right now, Lily. Lily's going out with a bang. Oh my gosh. Lily's gonna escape into freedom. Let me see, let me cut you off. I have to keep you in this area. This rook now will keep you in the danger zone. I gotta get an open file here somehow. I think maybe it doesn't matter where she moves now. Rook to h8. Take this pawn. And then I can staircase her, I'm pretty sure. I think that's probably going to be the best way to do it. I'm really hoping it is at least. <laughs> Die, king. <laughs> the brave, brave pawn. Oh, here comes another brave pawn. Okay, she still has places that she can go. If I take this pawn, stalemate's the only issue now. So if she takes this pawn, or if I take this pawn, she can still move here, or here, or that. Plenty of options. Plenty of options. Now I can try to staircase at least. Okay, yeah, I can do a uh, discovered check. And that won't do it though. Maybe I can just do it normal. Here, into the second rank, yeah. Here, then here. Oh, that's not gonna be enough though. Oh God, oops. <laughs> okay, well I guess I am moving. Where are we now? That's where we are? Okay. Yeah, if she goes right here, then the game will continue. <laughs> okay, good. Okay, well played. Lily, dude, what a doozy. What a doozy. <laughs> oh my gosh, Lily, that was, uh, that was fun. I hope you had a good time. That was the longest game we'll play tonight. Choose prediction. Zach did win. 91% of the people actually were believers this time. Thank you, guys. <laughs> uh, it objectively was not. Well, I hope you had a fun time at least. We got requests from all sorts of people. Um, who is next? We never played Blade before. Monster Icon just wants to be friends. I can accept that. Uh, Blade, Alchemy, and Benjamin. I don't think I've ever played against Alchemy before. Alchemy? I'll uh, I'll play Alchemy for one. Blade, we'll play a shorter one. Don't worry, I promise. I promise you. We'll do this. Oh, wait, what was this? Oh, that was just a friend request. Friend request. Wants to be friends. Sure, Benjamin. Um, someone send me a, a five-minute one now. That's what we'll do. And I think also fogofwarchess.com. I think there's this variant. I don't know if you can play this against other people for free. I think you can. Going fog of war chess. And I just want a normal ten-minute game of it versus... Can I do friends? Who wants to play? Bross really wants to play, but I've played I've played so much chess against Bross. Bross, I'm sorry. I want to give people a chance. All right, Blade still wants to play. We'll do Blade. We'll do Blade. If Alchemy still wants to play, then we can. So 91 Blade. I'm going to send you a request for this. 91 Blade. Does that work? Play fair. I agree. Does that work? Who am I playing against right now? Am I playing again? How do I even see who I'm playing against? Oh, I'm playing against Janny Bever? No, that's not what I want. Leave. Oops. I don't know. I wanted to play Fog of War. Janny Beaver. I don't know. I don't know. This is why I have you guys send me the requests. Five minute game. Five minute game. Who wants it? 
Ross, I'm sorry. I've played against you. Played against you too many times already. We can do Blade. Whoever sends me on first. Rather no fog. All right, Alchemy. That's fine. Just go ahead and send it. I want to do one fog game at some point. I just think it looks fun. Fog of War is the chessboard is you can only see what your pieces can see. So it's like if you uh, if you have a bishop that can see a square, then you can see what's on that square. But otherwise you can't. It's really crazy. All right, five minute game against Blade. This one will be more intense, I think, just being five minutes. We will see. Go ahead, Blade, make that move before the game auto aborts in six seconds. Uh oh. Good. Wow, D4. Interesting. Okay. I'll, I'll respond. I'll respond with D5. Ooh. That's, that's fun. Okay, trying to lock things up early on. I like that. Let's uh let's bring this knight in. No, I don't want to bring that knight in yet. Let's uh What do I want to do? Yeah, actually, let's let's do a, a King's Indian. Just to see how much fun we can have. He's got this knight going there. That's fine. King's Indian probably doesn't make sense at all because I can't even... This bishop's just going to take my bishop if I move my knight. Huh. I'm so slow. Let's just go. Let's just go for it. See if he takes it. Oh, oops. I didn't mean to move it there. Okay, well, it still works. I meant to move it here. Still works out, I guess. <laughs> I realized I was like, wait, why does this look so wrong? <laughs> Kabuki says, sorry I'm late. No worries, Kabuki. It's great to have you. Welcome, welcome. And make me dab from Vulpix as well. <laughs> uh, Alchemy, yeah, it is. It was five minutes. I think the next one we'll do will be one minute, though. So you can have that request ready. I might castle early. I don't even know what my development is right now. This feels super weird for me. I gotta get some better pawn stuff going. Maybe I try to castle on this side. How can I bring my knight into this? Got a million different thoughts right now. Let's go pawn. Then pawn here. And then I'll bring this knight here. And then blade will be scared. <laughs> Yeah, Blade has an actual opening right now prepared. I do not. Will says use my opening. Uh, Will with the knight. The knight is the first move. <laughs> it will be brutal. The one minute openings are scary. So let's see. If I bring my knight over he takes it and I take back and that's kind of better because it's a closed game I think I think I want to I'm okay with him taking this I'm gonna put uh, maybe I should do this first this is gonna open things up a little games that are really open you know where there's not a lot of pieces on the board bishops are really good for that because they can just see a bunch of squares but games that are closed, you know, a bunch of stuff going on, knights are a lot better because they can maneuver around. So they're considered to be equal in, like, point value. But I did learn that. So let's see, does he want to open this or not? I don't know what choice he really has here. Yeah, I don't know. I did think bishop out as well. Will thinks bishop out and then knight in front of the queen. Then move queen, then castle. <laughs> that would be good. Yeah, so he's putting more defense on this. I'm going to leave it like that for now. I'm going to go here. With some scary ideas for him. 
This knight is not protected in the slightest over here. I really wish it was. I do need to castle. I gotta get this, this knight into a good spot. Okay, so he does take it. Do I want to take with a pawn or do I want to take with a knight? Probably the knight because this knight's unprotected and it's out in the open in a bad, or it's like over on the edge in a bad spot. So I can take here. And then if he pushes me, I don't want to rotate here because then that's a very inactive square. So if he pushes me, I'll probably have to take him back. I'm going to do it. Bishop for bishop. Both of our bishops are gone now. The knights will survive. What is Blade thinking? He's a smart cookie. But is he smart in this way? Yeah, I think I'm going to bring my knight here next. And then I can bring my queen out and then I can castle. If I put my queen here on a5, it would pin his knight. Yeah, I don't know. I think he's probably going to end up castling on this side. But I've got a bunch of pawns ready to go. Yeah, so he's already castled. I want to break that side open. But I think for now... Yeah, because that knight's not going to be pinned anymore if I do it. I could take here. He's got two defenders on it. I only have one attacker. So I would take and he could take back. Hmm. Hmm. I don't think I want to do that. I'm going to bring my knight here. I think I'll bring my knight here. I want to get my knight into the action on this side. But I don't know how to. It's all very closed in. I would actually really prefer if he took this pawn. That'd be cool. If I take... He takes with his knight. doesn't remove any defenders um take, take, take I don't know man I don't know what the best course of action is I'm just going to take this. Oh, I have 43 seconds. Oh my gosh. This game is a lot faster than I thought it was. I got to kick it into overdrive. He'll take with this knight. What do I do after that? Then I take this pawn. Then he can take that pawn with his knight if he wants to. Then I can take that pawn with my knight. Then I'm up a pawn. Boop, boop, boop. Boop, I'm up a pawn. And his queen is like, not under attack, but can be seen. Oh, he went there. Okay. So that's different than what I thought. This is a good chance to bring this knight into things. Trade the queens, I guess. That's the idea. Let's try something. I don't know. I got 29 seconds. I'm going to have to start moving faster. What did he even take right then? Oh, it was a pawn. So now he has to take back. This pawn is in danger. And castle to get that pawn safe. That may be really short-sighted. I can connect my rooks also. If I bring this rook to the D file. All right, this one's intense. This one's getting more intense. Bring this pawn to the D file. And then I could try to like bring some pieces into this attack. Oh, see, he's being really annoying. 
I go here. I've got 20 seconds on my clock now. This is sad. This is scary. I only have 13 seconds. This is gonna get very fast, very fast. Oh, he's just gonna checkmate me probably. Check. Ah, uh, seven seconds. Oh my God, dude, Blade, I won on time. Holy crap, man, I was so not confident in my ability to win that or stay alive. Dude, GG, I didn't even know you were close to, to out of time. Holy crap, man. Yeah, I don't know how you were supposed to like finish the job there. Wow. Ah, oh, dude. Oh, me neither, he says. Wow, GG, Blade. GG. That was scary. I definitely think you were beating me at the end there. I mean, I don't even know what I was supposed to do. I want to see how bad I was losing. I win so many five-minute games on time. Oh, the Slav defense. Didn't even know I did that. Cool. Oh my gosh, Winston cheers. Good job. Blade, that was crazy. Yeah, look at that at the end. What did I do that was really bad? He went there, and then I went there. Why is that super duper bad? Because of that, I guess. Yeah. And then... He should have taken that... On... I guess. I thought that was a good move. It was a question mark. What was I supposed to do here? Oh, what? To here? What does that do? I guess it threatens that knight. Whatever. It was super close until we started being fast. Wow, okay. Well, good game, Blade. Crazy, man. Analysis time indeed. <laughs> I won't look at it too much. Puzzle Freak wants to be friends, of course. Okay, what challenges do we have right now? Guys, someone send me a, a, a one-minute match. One-minute match now. We're gonna do a one-minute, and we're gonna do a 15-second, and then we're gonna be done on chess. For the night. I've had my fill. Got a message? It's from Bear Man. Give orange me, give eat orange me, eat orange, give me, eat orange, give me you. Okay. <laughs> Why is Bear Man the way that he is? <laughs> Bros, I'm sorry. We've played so many times before. I just want to give other people a chance. Alchemy says he sent it. Like, I haven't played against Alchemy before. Did you send it? Where is it? Send another one. I think I might have gone away. Unless I'm not seeing something. Yeah, send it again, Alchemy. I told Alchemy I'd play him, so we, we'll do him next. There we go. Ah, but Bonzinator is also playing Stardew Valley right now, and the notification is getting in the way. There we go. Accept. One minute game. I'm sorry, Winston. Here we go. Whew. Let's do it. Take some space in the middle here. Develop everything. This is already scary. Hello, I'll get checked. <laughs> okay, interesting move. I'm castled up this time, I learned my lesson. If I check them over here now too. <laughs> I'm gonna win his queen, maybe? No, I won't win his queen, but I was kinda close. He moves his king. He can't. He can't move his king. He's got a block. I'm just out here wasting his time. Let's keep that thing there. Now that pawn is pinned. Ooh. He's on 15 seconds already. I should have just taken here. Alchemy, you gotta move! You got 10 seconds, Alchemy. Check. <laughs> uh, one and 
time. Alchemy, great game. Hello? Why is chess.com not saying this game's over? There we go. Alchemy. Oh, her? I Dude, why do I keep... I was so under the impression... Alchemy, I'm so sorry. I was so under the impression that I used to say her for you, and then you were like, I am a man. I'm so sorry. It's hard to keep track. Alchemy said I'm dizzy. I'm sorry. That was, uh, that was kind of rough. We can do one more. We can do one more here. We'll do... How do I do rematch? I think I exited out of where it says rematch. Alchemy, send me one more. Oh, man. Dang it, Alchemy. I'm so sorry. I literally do that every time. There we go. Another one. This time I am the black pieces. We're going to do the crab opening. We go H5, then A5. The all-out pawn push. Oh god, that's scary. I must advance all of my pawns. <laughs> so far, looking kind of similar. This pawn's just been hanging for like five turns. This is a little awkward in the middle now. Oh, how dare you? Why did I do that? Um. Oh gosh, what do I even do here? Now I gotta get knights involved. Except that knight now can't go anywhere. Wonderful. Oh my gosh, how dare you? I may have been a little bit too ambitious with the pawn opening. <laughs> as soon as I did that, I was like, oh no, but then it was good. Let's go. Uh. Uh. There. Dang it. That's also not good. Well, I, I don't have a lot of time. It's also not, I gotta win this on time. I'm already in time mode. What is that? I guess I'm attacking this pawn. Oh, I wasn't even, but... Dude, I don't even know. Thank you. I know she's got the bishop. Oh, the bishop. Should I eat it all? Oh, it's game over. Oh my gosh, dude. One minute games are insane. Wow. Alchemy, well played. That was fun. I hope you had a good time. Sam, I got your friend request. I'll accept that. Uh, yeah, I know. I, I feel like I do so good. Just like not saying genders for people, but Kabuki says, how can I play? Send it my way. Uh, I don't know. I'm sorry. I, don't, I literally don't know how to send people requests. Hey, our final game of chess for the night is going to be a 15 second one. So I think you can go new game. Hmm, how do you even do 15 seconds? More. Here's 30 seconds. Oh, you can do custom. 15. So you got to go one minute and then you go to custom. And then you hit 15. So we're going to do a 15 second one. Oh my gosh, that's insane. Yeah, dude, at the end, like if it's, if someone's running out of time, it just becomes about like wasting their time and just staying alive, you know? <laughs> Thank you guys for being understanding. Yeah, and Lily, sometimes I, like, there's people that come in here with, like, a very male or female name, and then they're the opposite. It's like, what am I supposed to do with that? I don't know. <laughs> Alright, someone send me that 15-second request. Anyone still waiting to get in, in particular? Atlas says, dang it, I missed it, I'm sorry. Atlas, I also told you, uh, I, I answered your question about the, the Discord imposters earlier. But I don't know if you were around or not. Yeah, it was a good game, Blade. We should play more in the future, if I ever have time to. 15 second, any takers? Any takers? If anyone's interested, say it in the chat so I know to wait for you. Or so I know to accept your offer. Right now, Puzzle Freaks Online, Blade, Alchemy, Sam, and Bross. They're all on, at least. 
Oh, you have to connect to the variant servers. Interesting. All right, I'll do Fog of War a different time then. Yeah, I'm not that into it. Puzzle Freak, do you want to play? We have not played a game yet. If you wanted to, you've got a spot. <laughs> Bros said oof. Also, Bros, I like if you want to play also, you can shoot me one now. I just wanted to give priority to some people who don't get a chance to play. What do we uh what do we think? And I yeah, I haven't played in a long time. Where's like recent games? Somewhere on this website, there's a list of like all the games you've played recently. I don't know where it is though. All right, Bros has a five minute one. Oh, it's five minute Bros. Do 15 seconds. We gotta do a 15 second one here. I can send it your way, I think. I think it's easy if you are playing friends. You can go one minute more. 15 seconds. Oh, Bros. Oh, no, 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 no. I just searched one. Dang it. Abort. Abort. I'm sorry to whoever that was. New game. More. 15 seconds. Okay. And now I want to play against a friend, Bros, in a 15 second game. There we go. Okay. That was harder to set up than it should have been. <laughs> Bros, you just gotta move fast, all right? Just gotta move fast. Oh, fall picks, I'm sorry to hear that. Yeah, this may not be the environment to learn then. Oh, Puzzle Freak challenged me? I'll play one against both. Bros, I'll play you next, don't worry. All right, here we go. <sighs> me versus Puzzle Freak in a 15 second game. That's not good. Oh, it's better than I thought. Just need to not get checkmated. Much easier said than done. Oh my God. Thank you for the queen offer. What is that? Take. Oh my God, dude. <laughs> Dude, what is that? Again. <laughs> what is that, dude? That is so insane. If you see people who are good at this play this, it is wild. They like literally play full games. Like they'll end games like this in checkmate. I saw a guy beat Stockfish on this. Like an ultra bullet like that. It's crazy. Rematch for Puzzle Freak. All right, one more quick one with Puzzle Freak, then we'll do one with Bross, and we're playing a Minecraft. Skyler, what is up? I know it's been so long. Dude, don't you even think about it. My man really just tried the Scholar's Mate me. Not falling for that. Although it did waste a lot of my time because I forgot how to defend against it. Oh God. I have one second. No, bishops don't move like that. Dude, I was pre-moving. I literally had that pre-moved. Oh, it's because he put me in check. Oh my gosh. All right, best of three. Best of three. We have to. Oh my gosh, I can't believe it. Dude, why, don't, why am I getting tips right now? I don't care. No thanks. Turn them off. Oh my gosh, that was wild. One more, it has to be a best of three here. That was a win for chat, absolutely. Oh, that was so wild. I'm doing it right back. Oh God, no. This isn't good. This is just survive. Get absolutely checked. Just keep wasting his time with checks. <laughs> yeah, baby! That's how you gotta do it. You just keep checking them and then they can't make the move they wanted to make. Oh my gosh, that was crazy.
Atlas, we have the rest of our games. Dude, I'll play a, a 15 second one against you if you want. You gotta, uh, if you can send it before I'm done with Bross, then we'll play. But you have to do this. You go to, uh, on chess.com, go to more for the time and 15 seconds. I'm sorry, we've been playing chess for like an hour. It's time to move on after this, but you go chess, set it to 15 seconds, play a friend or, uh, yeah, play a friend and then you can search up my name right there, just like that. But I am playing against Bross right now. I'm pre-moving. Should I just pre-move everything? Let's just start pre-moving stuff, see what happens. <laughs> okay, perfect. Good win, everybody. Oh man, what a uh, what a time to be alive. <laughs> Another one? I have an idea. <laughs> Bros says that was scary. All right, Bros, let's go again. I have an idea. <laughs> oh no. Oh, Bros, I'm so sorry. <laughs> okay, I think that was a good last one. <laughs> uh, six blunders in only 15 seconds. Can you imagine? Oh my god, that is funny. <laughs> Liquid asset. <laughs> oh, Mob Destroyer, thank you for the follow. I appreciate it. Guys, that's all the chess for the night. I hope that you had fun watching that. Um, thank you to everyone that played against me. I do appreciate it. Hopefully that wasn't too terrible for you. Guys, we're playing Minecraft next. I also just realized I was in the chess category that whole time. Oops. Um, we're playing Minecraft next, and we are, uh, hopping on our server. If you've never played on our server before, it's open to anyone, and I'd encourage you guys to come hang out with me. I've got a, a task that I want to work on personally for a little bit at least, and anyone is welcome to be a part of the operation. So if you want to play... I'll type into the chat right now, exclamation point, Minecraft. And there is the server link. So you just go to uh, unspassablez, or mc.unspassablez.com to get in on the server. I will show it to you guys here on the stream so that you can see it as well. Come on, Minecraft, load. There we go. Nice. So here we are. You just go uh, add server right here. Name it whatever you want. Server address is mc unsurpassablez.com. Boop. Well, let's hop in it. Let's see what's uh, what's going on on the server. It has been a uh, a very long time. I feel like uh, since we've updated the starter community farm. The last time we were here was I don't even know how long ago it was. A couple weeks ago, we were doing the build battle. So you can see here's the Unspassable Z, uh, Maryland and Pennsylvania flag. Oh no, it's Maryland and Master Chief. Of course, I moved from Master Chief to Maryland. We got the Twitch and the, the YouTube logo. That was built by my dad and my sister. And then this is the other really cool one, of course, from Colta. It was me riding atop Colta's shoulders as he mounts a flamingo. So we'll go Warp Town right here and I'll show you guys who's on right now. Anime Freak is here. Anime Freak's been playing a lot. Atlas, Monster Icon, PCG Matt, and Sketchy snoob as well uh i'm gonna real quick i'm gonna ping the discord server because it's been a while since i played minecraft and i did not announce it for a little bit so let me go at minecraft oh we don't yeah okay i thought we didn't have a minecraft rule for a second at minecraft we live there we go so here we are in the town <clears throat> i'm sure there's at least a couple people watching who haven't even seen us doing this this is a uh, stardew valley on minecraft so the farm area is modeled off of our community farm that we had a couple of months ago where we had an unlimited number of players. And so it's mostly just homes. But then over here is the bus stop area. And this is all built to scale as best as we could get it. Some of the areas don't line up perfectly um, just because of the way the game is. But we got Marnie's ranch right here. And here's Leah's cabin over here is like that dock area and the wizard's tower. 
and where you catch this legendary fish. There's some ocean out there. There's a huge project right now to expand the ocean all the way to the horizon. So that's kind of insane. Simply has been working on that a lot. Hey, Steelers2022 says, hello, Unsurpassable Z. Welcome. It's great to have you. Hope you're doing great. You got a gifted sub to the channel last stream from uh, Chowder, which is cool to see. Hope you guys are doing good. So then over here, there's one and two Willow Lane where our friends live. Here's the town square. There's a bunch of trees. This is all new. All these trees have been added as of recently, which is cool to see. There's Pierre's and Harvey and the saloon. And then there's George and Evelyn's house and Pam's trailer, Mayor Lewis's house. We've got Clint's shop and the museum. This is our like storage area unit. We have Joja Mart. Oh, it's so beautiful to see all of it. There's Willie's house and the rest of the beach. Over here, we have the community center. There's the fountain. There's Robin's house. Here's the mines and the lake. And the coolest part about this is on the inside of all of these places, it's actually like filled in. And so if you look inside a Joja Mart like this, you come down on the inside because it's bigger on the inside than it is on the outside. And we're working on filling out the inside of Joja Mart. So here's the floors. We've got room for the shelves. The walls are ready to be put in. This is, I'm cheating to get here, but this is Pierre's house. So you can see here's like the front area and Abigail's room. And then over here is her video game, or sorry, this is their uh, bedroom and the other like weird area where they just hang out. This is where they praise Yoba. Uh, up here is like their kitchen and then this is Caroline's tea room. So it's, this has been like months in development. So if you haven't seen it, I'm sure it's really cool. I am very, very excited. We're almost done with it. You know, like we still have some more interior work to do, but I mean, like, I would say the majority of the work is done and now it's just, you know, decorating. And so we're gonna need some help from the people. I think it's mostly just mods are trusted to work on the server right now, but if anyone else thinks that they would uh, make a good builder and want to contribute to the common good, I'm sure Simply Ed would really appreciate it. Break, dude, I feel like I haven't gotten to see you a lot recently, man. Got hives for some reason, I'm so sorry, Break. I hope that that's not too bad for you, though. Glad to have you now. Uh, so anyway, here we go. Oh, you're Anime Freak Volpix, I didn't know that. Very cool. I was wondering who that was. Gotta hydrate for alchemy there as well, of course. So all the interior of these buildings are filled out. I wanna work on the interior of Joja Mart, but I also wanna work on my giant faces project. And so I think I'll probably end up stealing from some of these chests in here uh, for this project. But my idea is, who do we wanna build first, guys? We have literally anything. I'm turning this game down a little bit. It's such loud rain. Um, what's like weather? Oh, weather. Turn that down. And then this was at like 43. Okay. So we have to decide whose face I want to build. So Stardew Villagers. We've spent a lot of time with these villagers. Here are kind of our options, right? We want to figure out who's going to be a good person to build. I think I want to do like a one to one block recreation of these faces. Maybe Pam is the best person to start. With. What do you think? Any, uh, any big... Oh my god, am I getting attacked? I am? Ow. Okay. That will probably stop, right? No. No, okay, cool. I haven't slept in too long. I gotta go find a bed somewhere. I'll hide in here for a second. Um... Yeah, I kind of feel like Pam is the best face to get going with. And conveniently, I already have Pam.png saved on my computer. <laughs> Let me pull that up right now. I have... Where, where is that saved, though? Yeah, I think it was the Stardew Super Fight folder. That's where I have that. Stardew Super Fight Pam.png. Here we go. This is our inspiration. This is our muse for the evening. People say Vincent as well. We got a request for a uh, Krobus. Could I do Krobus? Chowder, it's great to have you, man. I don't know. Let me check our supplies, because I, I think I also have to probably think about just what do we even have supplies to make? Because I don't know. Here's like obsidian. Probus is a very dark character. How am I going to make that out of Maybe these blocks? There's some more of this black stone. That's probably enough. Let me, uh, let me go sleep so these things stop attacking me. Real quick. Alright, we got two votes for Vincent. Two votes for Krobus. I think I might do Krobus. I think I'll do Krobus. Make that happen. I love old Kroby. Definitely like him more than Vincent, that's for sure. Slash AFK. 
Nice. So let's uh let's let's get a picture of Krobus up on the screen here for a second. Do I have I don't have Krobus.png. So I need to download that. Save image as. Just put them in the uh, Stardew Super Fight category again. This folder. There we go. And I'll actually just add him as a scene that you guys can see. So we'll go back here. Oops. Add image new Krobus and I want Krobus.png there we go so now we've got a little bit of inspiration <laughs> god he's so massive okay so this is gonna be mostly just the face shape then right I think with like black glass around the outside and otherwise just like a, the darkest stone we can find, I guess that dark brick, pretty much just that. So is, are there any experts in like star, like Minecraft, Minecraft pixel art, how, or general, how to, how do I even do this? I want to figure out like what blocks I need to place where, I don't know. I'm just going to go for it. I'll go for my own, uh, my own my own route to see if I can figure it out. Keen, thank you for the 20 bits. I appreciate it. It's, it's Minecraft, Em. I can't believe uh, Em was already on the stream with me two times earlier this week. So that's why she's not on tonight again. But man, Minecraft without Em. So sad. <laughs> Go back to Minecraft here. So I think I'm just going to take a bunch of this stone. I'm going to find a good spot. Black concrete if you can make it. That would be the best. I don't know if we have the materials for it, unfortunately. And I also don't want to take all of these. I don't want to take all of these bricks also, because this is also like partially for the uh, Stardew, the Stardew building effort. So I don't want to dip into these for too many other projects. I think I can take a little bit for some Krobus. So I guess I want to do this kind of close to spawn to figure this out. I figured there was some sort of tool like that, Matt. I wasn't sure what it was, though. Yeah, I figured that Will and, or Bryce and the Twins, not Bryce and the Twins, sorry. Uh, yeah, Will and the Twins wouldn't have just made that picture of me super easily. Yeah, I think I actually want to go to my home. I think I want to do this under my house somewhere. So can I do this, like, as an entrance down here? Oh, that would be kind of cool. So I think if I start digging through the stairs right here, this will take me to where I have my lava pit. You'll know what that is as soon as you see it. Okay, cool. All I have is an iron shovel. I think I want to do, like... I want this to be, like, under my house, I think. Okay, there is the, uh, the tool for it. Oh, M, thank you. Just sand and gravel? Yeah, I don't know. I never actually, like, collect too much on this. And I don't want to spend too much time collecting. I just want to do some building. Oh, there's Will PK coming in. It's all this dirt. Oh, that's not dirt. I'm a Minecraft noob. You guys call me Stardew noob all the time, but I actually am a Minecraft noob. What is this? Just a mine here? Someone's mine? <laughs> this is like directly under my house. Interesting. This must have been pretty early on in the server's life. I'm pretty sure there's a giant hole that runs right through the middle right here. I should hit lava any second now. Yeah, if you guys want to contribute sand and gravel, let me know. You can drop it somewhere and I can take it. Here we go. So this lava is part of my build. And so I think I want this to be the whole hallway. And it will come down here and then it will open up into like a corridor area that goes around all the lava. Let 
Maybe that should be it. Maybe it should just be this big open room in the middle. So I'm, I'm thinking I'll go here. It'll be this big open room. And there'll be like a layer of glass here. And then we'll build around it. I've got a vision. Don't worry, I've got the vision. This is like the centerpiece of my house, this lava fall. Let's go here. I think I'll start with Krovis being right on this wall. First order of business is figure out how wide this puppy needs to be. I think I might have to half scale it because this is a lot of blocks all in one location. You know, it looks like it's one... Uh, see, I don't know if I want to count this. I'm going to use the tool mat linked. Let me see. Upload. This is such a helpful tool. Twitch. Stardew Valley Super Fight. Probus. Convert. Oh, okay, there we go. It's actually not that bad. So it looks like it's... Oh, it actually is very quite bad now that I look at it. Um, It looks like I can get away with scaling this down half so I'll show you what I'm looking at so I'm seeing right here that like this you know like this little pixel is two by two on this website but I can just make it one by one so I can scale that all down so oops what is that so if I count how many over this is total Can I even do that? It's an easy way to count this. Is there like a measuring tool or anything? I don't know. Three, six, nine, 12, 15, 18, 21, 24, 27, 30, 33, 39, 42, 45, 48, 51, Oh my god, this is so big. I can I have to be able to scale this down more than that. Ah, I guess I can't. I don't know. And I lost track. Sick. He is so beautiful. He is so beautiful, though. I will do this. I will do at least Krobus down here. <laughs> Yo, 420 Soupy, dude. Congrats on the sub. Well deserved. Soupy, it's great to have you, man. I'm going to count this again. I'm sorry. Three, so, 3-6... Three, 9, 12, 15, that was 18, then 21, 24, 27, 30, 33, 36, 39, 42, 45, 48, 51, 54, 57, 60, 63, 66, 69, 72, 75, 78, 81, 84, 87, 90, 93, 96, 99, 102, 104, is that what that is? It's very inconvenient. So 104, so I would have to make mine 52, 52 wide instead of 104. Oh my God. So how wide is this currently? This is not 52 wide. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. 9, 10, 11. Sick. So that's 11, that's 12. Can I scale it down more than that? I'm afraid I can scale down Krobus, I'm sure. But I think other ones will be really hard to scale down any more than that. Like, let me look if I do, like, Pam or something. Open image. Like, how do you ever start to scale this down more than that? More like more than half. Oh my god, she's so she's such fine detail. <laughs> Scale down to 32 by 32. Yeah, what am I at? I'm at 52, did I say? So I would do uh 26 would be easiest for me. So how do you scale some of this stuff down? You know, like I would take each pixel would be half a block. Oh my gosh. How do I do this? Oh, I'm sorry, you can't see my Pam. Here we go. This is what I'm looking at. I did Pam. 
There is a scale at the bottom, but I, I, it wasn't like super duper accurate. I wanted it to be the right number. Oh my gosh, that is so massive, dude. Oh, this tool does it for you. Settings. That would be very helpful. How do I do this? Convert two commands? No, I don't want that. Dude, how do I do this? Yo, David, what's up, man? It is uh, kind, it's Stardew editing on Minecraft. We're gonna try to make Krobus on, uh, on Minecraft. David, it's good to see you, man. I hope you're doing good. Hope your stream's going well. Okay, maybe it's in those settings that I keep skipping past. All blocks. Only blocks from survival mode, of course. Oh, here, 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 image size. So let's do 32 by 32. Ew, see, that doesn't look like Krobus now. See, this is like, this is ridiculous, man. Oh yeah, David, if you guys want that panel, I can send it to you. Thank you, yeah, it matches all the other, the rest of my stuff. All right, we're just gonna do this. I think it's recognizable, kinda looks like him. Look, I don't wanna be too ambitious as I've been known to do. So let's, uh, let's set out a 32 area. Let's uh let's set out a 32 by 32 area here. What did I say this was? This is 12 currently. Right? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. And so we gotta go another 10 on both sides. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Cool. So there's that. And one, two, three, four. Uh oh. Oh, this is all underground. It's fine. Or. I don't have enough dirt. Uh, four. Is this one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten? Okay, that's actually perfect. So I'll put this here. To remind myself, don't go any further. So Krobus is gonna be this wide? My god, it's still so big. It is still so big. I mean, like, it's pixel art, so it's actually quite small compared to what it normally is. But yeah, I think it's doable. And then we'll go up from there. So we're gonna have to we're gonna have to go up here to make some space. This is what the inside of my house looks like, by the way. My dad built this pyramid of dirt that just encloses the whole area that used to exist. So let's go up with it now. Thankfully, this is like the best area to do it. Because a lot of it is already... A lot of it's already cleared out. So let's go up now. So I'm at 1, 2. It's 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. God, this is gonna be so massive. It's 12. 15, 14, 15, 16, 17. Oh my gosh. I know you guys can't see like anything, so that's 17. Oh my god, dude. 17. 18, 20, 21. 22, I'm gonna hit the surface. 22, 23, 24, 25. I'm too close. So that's 25. Let's uh, let's go down a little bit. I gotta relax, I gotta back off. I need this dirt. Oh, hey. <laughs> Why can't I break this dirt? So that's 24 again. 23, 22. Oh my gosh. I did not think I was going to be digging an area out for this. Maybe I shouldn't dig it out. Ah, oh, it's so cool though. That's 22. 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Oh god, is that 32? I think it is. 
Oh my gosh, that's massive, man. That is massive. Should I just do this project outside somewhere instead? Or should I do this underground? Like a secret underground Krobus shrine. I kind of like the underground part of it. Okay, let's clear the space out. I do like the secret shrine-ness of it. There's gonna be a lot of digging for a little bit here. It's just this random thing here again. I don't know, man. Do I wanna... Do I wanna dig all this out? What do you guys think? What do you guys think? Dude, Monster Icon, thank you for the gifted sub, man. I appreciate it. I'm sorry we didn't get to play chess. Um, but he gave... He gifted a sub to, uh, Knight and Dave. Wow. Dude, thank you, man. I appreciate that, Monster Icon. Why did you say at Knight and Dave first? <laughs> do you know him? Well, either way, dude. Thank you, uh, Monster Icon. Thank you for the gifted sub, man. I do appreciate it. It's awesome that it goes to him, man. Secret even better dig. All right, if you guys don't mind watching me dig for a little bit, I don't mind digging. It's going to be so beautiful when we're done with it. I may cheat. I'm going to use fly mode a little bit here, I think. I need a beacon. That's what I need. Anyone want to hook me up with a beacon somewhere? Or teach me how to make one? See, what I really need is simply Ed. He is the beacon. The human beacon. Oh, I kind of want to tell you guys also, I have a, uh... Nah, see, that's the second time I've started telling you guys. And then I decided that I, uh, actually... I want to keep it a surprise. Okay, so when you're in fly mode... I think it actually takes longer to build, or to dig. So I actually want to do this, like, organically if I can help it. probably so many better ways to do this than the way I'm doing it. A beacon block and put a diamond blocks under it. Ah, oh, dude. Yeah, I don't know. Maybe someone else will just build it for me. That would be exciting for me, but it's okay if not. The faces of Stardew Valley. Dude, imagine like just this big monument to all of them. <laughs> Kabuki. <laughs> Maybe I could do it, uh, I could also do it in, like, a public area. Then you guys could help me dig. I don't know if anyone would even be willing to help me, though. Yeah, Simply Ed has been working on the, uh, on the server so long. It's been putting so many hours into it, just in total. It's very appreciated. Snoop says he will dig. Do we have any other help? Any others? Will will also help. All right, I've done such I've done such good work here. Oh, cinnamon not ginger is on too. All right, come on in, boys. And trust a uh, sketchy snoob. Come on down, boys. I will give you permission. Vulpix wants to help. Alright, thank you. Please just don't kill me or grief me or anything. I trust you guys. Come on through. Under my house. Ah! There's no, like, uh... No solid method as to how I'm cleaning this out yet. Just a bunch of digging. Oh, you play Stardew Valley on the Switch? That's fun. Yeah, I did a, a YouTube poll recently that was like, how do you play Stardew Valley? And besides PC, that was the biggest group of people. Which I thought was cool. Did Snoop send a request? Oh, he did. TP accept, come on in. Will is gonna help. The troops are rallying. See, we got this area going. See, I'm, I'm almost done digging it out, I feel like. Because a lot of it was up. But now I'm just going... It's like a little bit down yet. And a bunch of this area is already open. So maybe I didn't even need the help. <laughs> Everyone's coming to help. I don't even think I need it anymore. 
We could dig out another one. Welcome. The troops are rallying. See, because I kind of want to do the same thing. Like, along this line. So we can have another one if we wanted to. So if anyone wants to... Like, if we finish this one up, then you guys could start digging that way. But that's unnecessary. Nice. Yeah, see, this is just massive. I feel like you're going to need a big area just to experience it. <laughs> Always prepared to play Stardew at a moment's notice. That is funny. Yeah, I, uh, I only own it on PC. I couldn't imagine playing this game mobile. It's just so weird to me. Not this game, obviously, but Stardew Valley Mobile. A bunch of people play it that way, though, too. Those people don't tend to watch my videos, though, because 1.5 still isn't out for mobile, which is sad. Kenzie's got it on mobile, though. That's cool. Yeah, I think uh, I bought Minecraft multiple times. It's not because I have a like burning love for Minecraft. It's just because there were so many times that I kept wanting to play Minecraft and then I didn't have it on my old console anymore. Like I had it for the 360. Then we got, or yeah, then we got an Xbox One. And I bought it again for the Xbox One. Then I wanted to play again, but it was like on PC. So I bought it on PC. I spent so much money just buying the base game of Minecraft. It's really quite sad. It is cool that mobile even exists as an option, though. Ow. Yeah, my dad, like, just covered all this stuff up and did not put any torches down. Do you want sand and gravel for the build? Yeah, if you've got sand and gravel, then go ahead. I will, uh, I will accept donations in that way. Oh my god, there's too many bad guys around here. Out here fighting for my life because we didn't mob proof this area under my house. I never got to babysit. I always thought that, that would be fun. Like, I'm not at all at this point in my life ready to be a dad, but I think when I am a father, which is something that I want to be eventually, like, I think I'm going to have a lot of fun. Because I kind of am a child anyway. And so whenever I have kids, I'll get to just, you know, enjoy being a kid and pretend like it's, you know, just all for them. But in reality, it's a little bit for me, too. <laughs> yeah, I also kind of thought it would be too janky. I was surprised that you could even play Stardew on mobile or on uh, on console. You know, when I found that out, I thought it was just a uh, for a little bit. I thought that it was just PC. So I was surprised you could play it on a controller. And then they were like, yeah, you can play on your phone, too. That was something I had to look up for that community poll the first time I posted it. Like, which platform do you play Stardew on? I had to look up what platform Stardew was even available on. Because I didn't know, and I didn't want to miss any. I didn't want to be like, do you play on PS4? And then they were like, oh, it's not actually on PS4. Been awkward. This is coming along. I don't know how far down I need to go. I gotta meet with this level over here. Whatever this is. Wow, is this the bottom? We're almost there. We got like a little bit there. Go here. Put a torch down so we can see. Oh, this is the sand. I see. I was like, man, how did how did all this sand get here? Okay, cool. Actually I hit anime freak and now I can't build in this claim. Wow, so much sand. Get rid of that. All right, did I get it all? All right, I got it all. Thank you for the donation. Let me go run that to the chest. Nice, guys. You've done well. Yeah, my dad plays on controller for Stardew. I can't. I can't imagine. I think it's just so much easier keyboard and mouse. How did those get here? Oh my god, when did all of these get here? See, this is why I wasn't going to trust anyone to build in my house. They're being bad. Okay, let's uh, make... I can just stash this, I guess. 
Oh, that's all cut sand stone. Sand, sand, sand. I need some gravel then. But I think otherwise, I might just build him with the uh, the bricks that I picked up. The black stone. I don't think it'll be a big deal. <laughs> Jenny, what is up? It is Minecraft indeed. We're building Krobus right now. Let me make space here. Let me go back to the tool. Just come on. Where did this water come from? That needs to go away. Let me go back to the tool now. Actually, I'll see... Will wants to teleport. Oh no, I'm not teleporting to Will here. Yeah. Yeah, we got that under control. Don't worry. Also, this lava needs to not be there. Oh, I see. You guys are trying to fix that actively. Yeah, go ahead take care of that issue. I don't know how that happened. I hope that didn't spill into the main area, because that took a while to get right. Let me look. How do I get out of this person hole? Oh, Ginny, I'm sorry to hear that. Sit back, relax, watch the stream, hang out with us. Hopefully you feel better. I do hope you feel better, though. Ah, dang it! That's going to take so long to fix now. All right, well... We got the digging done, at least. That was the uh, the hard part. Come down here. Let me make sure the digging is actually done here. Okay, this all still needs to get dug out, right? This high level. Right? This isn't surface, is it? We gotta dig all this out. It's alright, we'll cross that bridge when we get to it. Let's start from the ground of Krobus. Ah, I can't step back and look at any of this? This is so hard. I was really hoping I'd be able to, like, step back and take a look. Let me look at our, uh, our picture of Krobus. Let me screenshot this. And I can pull it up for you guys to see. Or actually... Yeah, here. I'll add this as a source. Yeah, add chrome. There we go. So I can turn this on and off and I can show. So Krobus is, let's go 11, 22, 23 wide. It looks like. Let me count again. It's 11. That's 22. Oh, 25 wide. I'm sorry. 11. 22. He's 25 wide at the base. And that goes up for 11. So that's quite easy, actually. Turn that off. Oh, and how many? There's a gap of... 3 before that starts. So where's our bottom corner, right? I think this will be the left of him. And so we'll go here to this corner. There's a gap of one, two, three. This is the first one. So this is 11 high. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. And then that goes over for 25. Oh my gosh. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen. 20, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, oh, 25. That's the end of him. And then is there a gap of 4? There is. Cool. So now all of this gets filled in. Oh my gosh. All of this craziness gets filled in now. With just this black sandstone. That is absurd. I was so under the impression this would be an easier task than it has been. Jenny, thank you for the hydrate. I appreciate that. I think it's uh it's just 20 it's just 25, because I think the whole thing's yeah, the whole thing's 32 wide, and there's a gap of four on this side, but there's only a gap of three on the other side. And so I think it works out. 
I appreciate you keeping an eye out, though. Let me just fill all this in now. It's all incredibly dark. Is there a way that I could light this up temporarily? Try to light it up as I go. Or I can go ground up. Oh gosh, I don't have enough of this. I don't want to go the whole way here. Just like that. Boop, boop. I can just fill it in from the bottom up. If my, uh, if my people who are digging want to start maybe making like a cool little looking area, I don't know. I'd like to be able to like dig this out in the middle, right? Like this way so that we can take a step back and look at it. Even if only a couple blocks. Honestly, though, this may be a project for the future. I was thinking that we could just dig this out by hands, but I realize you need so much space, so much. And I'm almost out of this material already. I might have to give up on this project, dude. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay, well, here's the deal. This project, I think, looks good. I think it will be good. I want to come back to this for sure. Don't fishing rod me. Thank you, Matt, for fixing the lava column. All right, cool. Uh, I think in the off time, I want to get more of this material. I appreciate everyone's willingness to help out with this. Like, thank you for the sand donations. We got some gravel also. Get rid of all this cobblestone. Thank you to everyone. Stone. Is there more gravel? There is. Okay. There we go. I got all that. Thank you so much. Who was that? They're already gone. Like a vision in the night. You guys keep digging for a little bit. I'm going to go back up. I'm going to drop this off. Ow. Getting yoinked. Monster Icon's going to dip out. Have a great night, guys. Have a great weekend as well, Monster Icon. All right, let me donate all this or put this in here. Yeah, I think we'll dig all this area out in the future. That'll be a fun little future project. Let's put everything in there. All right, here's the deal. I think uh, I think this is way more of an undertaking than I thought it was going to be. I think I'm going to uh, take a take a, tie, uh, a time out on this. I really wanted to see this happen, man. I really did. But it's just uh, it's a big project. And uh, I think I might end early. As well. I told you guys I'm probably going to end up ending early during some of these weeks. Because I just have too much. Uh, I, I'm working full time now. And that was the project I wanted to work on. I got Will's fishing rod broke. Uh, yeah, I got some stuff I got to work on also. But uh, So I will end early tonight. I hope you guys had fun hanging out with me. Like I said, we're not going to do any more like full variety streams from now on. From now on, we're just going to do like all of them are a mix of Stardew and variety. Uh, but I appreciate you guys hanging out with me. I really do. Sorry we didn't play for too long. I was uh, not struck with the inspiration I was hoping to be struck by. But thank you guys for joining me. Really, I do appreciate it. I will see you guys again on Monday. I'm ending early for now, though. I will talk to you all soon. Can of Worms literally just came in here, dude. Says, uh, that's all right, bro. Hope you get lots of work done. Thank you. I appreciate it. I, uh, yeah, got lots of work to do as well for both uh, stream and work as well. So goodbye, everyone. Thank you so much. I will talk to you soon. Peace.